Hello, awesome froggy friends. Welcome to the channel. I'm Lord of the Tree Frogs, and today we are back here on Crystal Isles here in Ark Survival Evolved. Now, last time we left off, we uh we kind of had an adventure home, got lost, you know, uh, brought Jerboas back, lost Jerboas, and uh, but we're we are home safe and sound now. Uh, last episode we tamed these raptors, uh, this Fourth uh, of July raptor, which uh, leave. Leave names down below, because that video for me isn't out just yet. Oh, she laid an egg. That That is an unfertilized egg, by the way. And also this level 90 raptor. I think it was like a 62 baseline, but... All right, so today I was wanting to hatch out some raptor babies. As you can see, I, I, I uh, one already hatched out. I was just breeding out a bunch of eggs so that I could hatch them on camera, but uh, this one, <laughs> I forgot to turn off mating, so this one kind of escaped. As you can see, it's a level 67. I already leveled it up just a little bit, but yeah, so uh, we'll get the pretty colors of this one and hopefully the high stats of the level 90. So let's let's run on over. Oh, I'm running out. Oh, yep, and off camera as well. I built this uh, dodo coop for all of our uh, dodo friends. As you can see, Warrior's just uh, passed out. I, I don't know what, what happened here, but he's just passed out in the dodo coop. Like, you know, like, I mean, that's a totally normal thing to do. Yeah, as you see, I, I, I've been breeding the dodos like crazy, and they've actually started to get mutations. Like, if you look at this one here, the, the orange face on it, that, that is a mutation. So, yeah, <laughs> I think that shows how many I've been breeding. Anyway, though, so uh, let's see. Furt. So we're going to hatch out some raptor eggs today. Alrighty, guys. We've got seven seconds left. We're going to have, hopefully, a high-level baby raptor. So let's see. <gasps> Twins! All right, all right. Um, uh, uh, okay, no, no, get, get Hey, 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 don't quit running from me. Hey, I'm, pre I'm pressing E. I'm pressing E. Oh, jeez. This is, uh, it's not... Okay, good. Okay, uh, get some meat. Get some meat. Here, here's some meat for you. And, uh, where's the other one? Ah, yes. Look how cute they are. So, they didn't pick up any of the dad's colors? Maybe they... Maybe his feathers. Maybe the feathers. Yeah. Oh, and the white tummy, but... Everything else they picked up on the mom. Interesting, interesting. Oh, ooh, and these are both female too. I think the other one's female. So if we have a high level male, we can we can have high level like killing machines. Oh yeah, they got the white tummy and the orange feathers. What are your? Huh? But none of the red, the uh, blue and white. Interesting, interesting. Oh, and another one. Ooh, ooh, what is? Okay, uh, let's get food on you. It's it. These have all turned out different from each other. I did not expect to see such a wide variety. Hi, what? What did? Did you get a mutation? No. Hmm. No mutations. Then what? What orange color is that? Or is that? Is that your mom's orange color, but with a different... I don't know. Where did you... Is that on your dad? Huh. Interesting. And as you see, she's already higher level than her two sisters over here as well. Yeah, these are 39s. This is a 45. I want to say that blue one came out like... Maybe it was a 45 too. Yeah. Yeah, it very... Uh, I didn't really remember because, again, she was kind of a accident alrighty we're about to hatch out the last egg that I had stocked up Ooh, this one's a 52 they just keep getting higher and higher levels oh my goodness oh let's let's see you Ooh, and he picked up at least from what I can tell all of the dad's colors except for the belly which is the mother's green belly but if he's a level 52 I, I have to check the stats I'm gonna I'll have to check the stats of the Raptors to make sure I know which ones the best stats from each that got passed on to this little guy here but if he got the good stats that he might replace his dad as the pretty breeding Raptor 
Because, I mean, what was that, level 9 baseline? This one's a level 52 baseline. So, you, you've you got you've got a bright future ahead of you, little guy. So, I mean, look at look at how cute all these guys are. I, I noticed this, too. Look at their little tails. They're just like little feather dusters. Look, you can especially tell them this. Look, just like little feather dusters, just dusting a shelf. Just <laughs> anyway, leave name suggestions for these guys or... This guy and these gals down below. Who's a proud raptor mama? Are you? Hey, hey, are you a proud raptor mama? Huh? Are you? Are you? I think you are. I think you are. Also, while we wait for these raptors to go up, what? To go up, grow up, because I need them for our my plans that I have had that I planned out today. Uh, I al we also got some name suggestions from the premiere of a couple episodes back, but for this little green and white Jerboa friend. So we're going to name him... Drum roll, please. Oh, nope. Tamaru? I think. I think that's how you spell his name. But the little Bonacle character, the Matoran from Bonacle Generation 1, who's, uh, who's mostly green. So, oh, yeah, he has blue on him too, doesn't he? This little Jerboa has blue on him too. So, hey, that turns out just perfect. Just doing some cleaning out here. Put it into literal crap folder. Yep. All right, but yeah, my 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 hopes for this was that we'd have so many dodos that we'd have an endless supply of meat, but I didn't even consider this. But look at this. We have 55 dodo eggs right here. Right? We other than making like kibble and stuff with it, we could just strictly eat dodo eggs and be fine. We wouldn't even have to have meat other than to tame carnivores and do event stuff like again, other than the fact that, you know, dodo eggs are significantly heavier to carry than meat. Oh yeah, and another thing, I almost forgot to do this. Another thing I wanted to do this episode was um well, a little bit of explaining first. Well, you remember the last couple episodes there's been some uh some harrowing uh, moments, uh, kind of scary, kind of dangerous. I thought Cooler Floridasaur was going to die several times. So, you know what? I decided that we need to have a backup. If Cooler Floridasaur ever should die or get hurt, we would have at least another Parasaur to do it. Her first child I bred off camera was this, Para Floridas, with uh, P Warrior's placeholder Parasaur right here. But if you remember, he was like, he was like level 9 or something. So, although... Although Parafloridus is 48, that's pretty good, but we need we need a better one. So I take this relatively higher level Skullson here, which if you can think of a better name, leave again the names in the comments down below. Uh, but we're going to uh, we're going to hatch out a uh, replacement Parasaur right now. So I've got the egg right here, and we'll just uh, how long is it going to take? Okay, about about a minute and a half so we're going to breed out or breed out well i guess that's already happened we're going to hatch out a replacement parasaur so i'll just uh zoom up until it hatches out oh here we go Alrighty. oh my goodness it looks exactly like the father, Skullson. So leave your names down below. It is a male, and I don't have any berries on me. Oh no! Uh, resource pool, uh, berry. Which, if you're if you're new to the channel, new to Ark, uh, you unfortunately you can't resource pool in the base game of Ark. No, that that is Structures Plus, a, a mod which I have our uh, mods in the description. But that's how I'm uh, able to pull resources. Other than that, because if I didn't have that, I'd have to run over to something that had that in its inventory and transfer it. But look at this cute little guy, though. Let's let's see him. Let's see him come running. Let's see him come running. Oh my goodness! Look at him. Here, here, here. We need to change your follow distance, little guy. Oh, that was the wrong button. All right. Uh, let's. What am I? Disable wandering. Thank you. Behavior. Follow distance. Lowest. Come on, let, let's watch him. Oh, look how cute he is! Oh, look at him, it's a little parasaur with a little white head. Alrighty, well, so, I guess we'll just wait for him and the raptors to grow. 
Oh, okay, good. Uh, I thought I almost said go up or glow up again. My goodness. To grow up into adults so that we can ride them and uh, get started on t uh, the plans I have for today. If I could talk, please. Alrighty, guys. Before we go on and do the next thing, I just wanted to give you guys an update here. I bred the... Um, here, I'll just show you. Uh, quit following. I bred... These two, uh, not this, these two raptors, right? Because this raptor here has really good health, but as you can see, really bad stamina. Where this raptor has much better stamina, but really bad health. So I bred those two together to get a, uh, to hopefully get both of those stats, and it worked. As you can see, this raptor has the good health and the good stamina, so that's nice. Did you get a mutation? Oh, no, that's just the... Did he get a mutation? Or is this just the family tree? I don't know. That must just be the family tree, yeah. Because uh he he's kind of he's kind of like a uh he he he's definitely inbred, but yeah. Alrighty guys, I was just about to head off to my next project. And look. Baryonyx. I think the raptors should be able to. Let's whistle neutral. Throw the boomerang because the, the berries will stun you. If you're in the water, so if we can get him to come on our turf, on onto the land, is that gonna hit him? No. If we could get him to get out of the water, so he can't stun us. Uh, maybe I'll shoot him with an arrow. Will that work? Oh, miss. And these are trank arrows. I don't want to waste them. Let's see. Aim just a bit above. No. Alright, raptors, come here. Ooh, if he can get... And there's a Sarko there, too! What, what is all the bad stuff doing over here? Oh my goodness, there's a Sarko and a Baryonyx? And this is close to our house, too! Uh, what are we gonna do? We gotta get that berry out of the water. Hmm. Do I have bullets? Cause, you know, if if I die, it's not as bad as if one of our tains dies. You know what? We're just gonna lower the stuff out like that. <laughs> All right, raptors, raptors, raptors. There's a circle after me. Where is it? Where is it? There he is. Kill it. Ooh. Hey, what do you know? Oh, here the... Okay. Oh, okay. Alright. We, we, we took care of the Sarko. Don't follow. Here, Barry. Here, Barry, Barry. Come meet me. Yep, there we go. Alrighty, come on over here, boys. Whistle. Yes. Kill it. Kill it. <laughs> They seem to be handling it. Don't go in the water, guys. Get back. Oh! Alrighty, they nice job, guys. Nice job. Whew. Alrighty. Well, that was a close one. Alright, guys, here's a capro. Kill it, kill it, kill it before it gets me! Oh dear! Oh, 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 what's going on? Uh, 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 three, three. Oh. Oh. Oh, it oh it jumped at me! Oh my goodness! And I did I can't remember what button my keys were on or my uh I can't even talk. Whew! I can't remember. I didn't remember which key my uh, pike was on. Which as you can see here, I've got a metal pike. I got it from a supply drop. It's pretty much like the spear, just uh, better, and you you can't throw it unfortunately. So, whew! But we we survived. The Caprosuchus. These these raptors are really good. Wow. I, I don't feel confident taking them against like a Spino or something. But they they can hold their own pretty well. Alright, let's see what's in this supply drop here. It's a low level one, so it's probably not going to be anything good. Thatch structures. Huh. Man, the crystal wyverns are so... Beautiful at night. Just look at them. Look at the presence that they just take up in the sky. 
truly remarkable. Alrighty, this is, uh, this is weird. There's one close to our house, but an aberration char- what is this called? Charge node. You, I think you make element in these, don't you? Oh yeah, but you need a ton of stuff. All aberration resources, yeah. I don't even, I don't even think we have aberration resources, like, near us. But yeah, you see it, it lights up and it glows. Uh, I don't know what it would be doing here, because it's not like there are any nameless to weaken, but just thought I'd share that with you guys. Alrighty, you guys, I was I was heading for the bottom corner of the map, hoping that the desert would hook up to the White Shoals. It doesn't. So we're going to have to swim across. However, I don't know if this is better than the area we went before, but I see quite a few islands in between there so we're just gonna we're gonna try it here hopefully hopefully no piranha or anything comes let's check the waters Keep checking all right we're good there Ooh, there is something out there though what what is that going to be multiple things what are you guys okay oh they're dolphins okay well you know fish dolphins lizard Dinosaur dolphins, but dolphins nonetheless. Alrighty, what else? What's over here? What are y'all? What are you detecting? Ooh, manta. Ooh, several mantas. Ooh. Alright, well, hmm. Alright, it's thin enough. We, if we get across quick, we'll, we'll, we'll might be able to survive. Just keep scanning. Because, okay, yeah, I see the dolphins are friendly. I don't know why they're classified as enemies but oh okay dilos that those won't in theory mess with us oh yeah actually they will what do you know here raptors that just uh would you would you just handle those guys real quick thanks all right hmm this is a lot of water over here this uh this doesn't make me feel very very confident maybe i should have gone see where those crystals are maybe i should have headed up is that a megalodon? Oh, compies, compies. Uh, uh, where's my raptors? Where, where are the raptors? Go away, go away. Uh, where are the raptors? Uh, they're still over here. What are you guys doing? Hey. Oh, <laughs> they got stuck on each other. What? Because all the raptors are following here. Uh, following this one, this is the highest level one. Yeah, so you see, she's the like pack alpha. Yeah, <laughs> oh, I love it when they do that. Yeah, hmm, I don't. It's weird though. I, they got stuck on each other. Is that a megalodon? It's gone now. <laughs> uh. <sighs> oh, more, more compies? Okay, well, you know what? Die, trash. Die. Good. Don't, look at the look at these dumb things. I hated them in Jurassic Park, and I hate them here. Oh, but my parasaur got that kill. Nice. <sighs> I'm stalling. I'm stalling. I know. I know. I'm stalling. Stalling. Ing. <laughs> uh, should we cross? Should we cross? Let, let's check it out. What what's under here? Oh my god. Okay, that is a megalodon out there, but this is deep water. What is that thing over there? What is it? Is it an elite sickness? But there's nothing under here. Oh, oh gosh, I think that megalodon's coming. Oh, oh, he's not. Ooh. Uh, ah, what do we do? What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Um, hmm, what, what's... That's one right there. You know what? You know what? I think I'm gonna go back and go the way we did before, because at least there were no megalodons over there. So I'm gonna go back the way we did before. <sighs> yeah, this is this is kind of a uh, roundabout trip was kind of a bust. I'm gonna go around the way we did before and let you guys know if anything's inter interesting happened.